Hello everyone, welcome to this video and today I'm going to be teaching you another method that you can use to do shadows and lights like shading in Adobe Photoshop. I have already made two videos on this, like the first part and the second part and there are different methods so if you want to watch them go to my channel and there they are. So yeah. Uh, this sphere that you're seeing here I made it using the method that I'm gonna teach you today so let's get started I'm gonna copy this layer up here so I can do the same thing okay first of all we have to create two, la two more layers one is going to be for the lights and the other one is gonna be for the shadows right so what you wanna do is right click and create clipping mask I'm gonna explain what this means so basically what this means is that if we draw in this layer we're gonna draw only over the object that we have on the bottom so perfect now I'm gonna select here my brush and the hardness I'm gonna put it in zero and I want to pick like a bigger size for the brush like I think like this is gonna be good so yeah this is gonna be good so now what I, I'm going to do is I'm going to select like a like a light blue here or I would take it more purple like this something around here and this layer I'm gonna put it in multiply mode and now as you can see it works to create the shadows so I'm gonna be creating the shadows over here as you can see really easy okay great so now here we have the shadows of the sphere and now I'm gonna do the lights so for the light I'm gonna select white but I'm gonna put the layer on overlay maybe I wanna make this a little bit no this size is good yeah so here as you can see there we have the light and other thing that we can do is we can create a little bit of reflective light on the other side here a little bit to make it look more realistic and for those of you who don't know why I'm doing this is like let's say there's a wall here well the light that is coming this way is gonna bounce here and it's gonna make a little bit of reflective light here and that's it so yeah as you can see it was really easy to make really simple and even if you can if you want you can create a new layer and put like a black point over here or whatever you want I don't know <laughs> but I like it more I like it more this way and yeah that's all the tutorial that's all there is to it thank you for watching and I hope this really helps you a lot uh, remember to check out the other two methods that I have in my channel the part one and the part two of these tutorials and in my channel I have a lot more tutorials of Photoshop and Flash so if you are learning and you want to learn more subscribe because I will be <coughs> uploading videos every day like I've been uploading videos every day for a while now so yeah subscribe and yeah I hope this helps you and see you in the next videos.